Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to the game where I have a very annoying cat. Get out of my freaking investment, you little jerk. Anyways, we're back out in Garden Simulator. If you remember in the last episode, I invested all my money into primroses. And look at this. They have fully grown. They are very, very beautiful. But now, actually, they haven't all fully grown, clearly. Um, it looks like most of them have, unfortunately. Okay, but they are all watered, so we're going to end today, and tomorrow is the big day. We're going to uh, see how much money we earn by harvesting those, and yeah, we're going to move on and see what else we can do in this oddly specific simulation game. Okay, and now they are all ready to be picked. This, I don't even remember how much this is going to be. Uh, 103 each? Okay, uh, that's good because I've actually unlocked, I believe, the sprinkler? And I think I'm pretty close to the lawnmower. I would love to get those set up because uh, I don't want to do those things anymore. Oh my god, this is taking so freaking long. You know what? There's got to be a skill that I can upgrade to deal with this. The harvesting speed of vegetables and fruit. What, what, what about flowers? Oh, florists would probably be that. All right, so we're going to upgrade our florist skill by as much as I can. Jesus, this actually takes... I'm not even that far. Well, that took frigging forever, but look at that. 18,000, almost 19,000. I forgot to water this one yesterday, so we'll have to harvest that one tomorrow. But uh, that is a lot of money. I don't think I'm going to have money issues for a while now. Let's actually see how much the lawnmower is. The lawn robot, I actually need to mow a little bit more, unfortunately, and build some stones for that. But I should have the watering uh, system set up. Where is that? Ah, uh, yes, the sprinkler right here. So that I can already unlock. And how much is it? A hundred? Oh my god, that's nothing. I Okay, let's see how these things work first, though. We might actually need, like, hoses. So we might only be able to connect one. But if I can have this whole thing automatically watering, that would be fantastic. Where is it? There it is. Let me catch it with my face. All right, what do we got here? How does this thing work? Okay, so there's a radius. Um... Do I have to put it on the ground? Because the radius drops when I put it on the ground. Can I have it, like, high up? No, clearly not. That's unfortunate. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's the saddest sprinkler I've ever seen. All right, I think I broke my sprinkler because it won't go on now. It might be a time thing and it just turned on at the right time. So I'm going to have to buy a lot more of those. Thankfully, they're cheap. So we'll definitely get quite a few of those. We also have a packaged landing zone. I kind of like it that they randomly throw these at me, but they do actually damage my crops, I believe. So we'll buy that as well. And let's buy, I don't know, I, I'm rich. We'll buy 20 of these for right now. All right, so now we have this package landing zone. We'll keep it over here. Can I rotate this? Rotate, there we go. Pretty big zone, but it should now stick in there. Perfect. I just want to see how far these sprinklers go. I'm assuming it's the radius of the circle. Um, But I want to see if they can possibly reach these plants. I doubt it. Okay, yeah, they don't even turn on unless they're by plants. Why are these things so sad? Oh my god, I'm gonna need so many of these. But that should have watered, obviously, these two. Oh my god, it waters one. It doesn't even... Oh my god. Okay, so what I'm gonna have to do, unless I change this a lot, is like, I'm gonna have to put these... Shut up, kitty! Oh my god, you're so annoying. All right, now it's actually not even watering the one that it's right on top of. It's watering the two side ones. Okay, there's going to be some strategy when it comes to placing these things. But they are worth it. Because screw watering myself. All right, let's not worry about gardening right now. That's not important in gardening later. I want to see... Because we can build with beams and ramps and everything. I want to see if we can build something with these. So, how much are these? They're locked. Oh. All right, well, we can only get the floors for right now. But I'm just curious. I also want to try out my new thing, see if it actually works. So, let's see if we get our boxes put perfectly in here. And here they come. Yes, that's so much better, actually. Thank you. Okay, so we can have, like, pillars. Oh, my God, they don't even snap into the ground. <laughs> so I can have, like, topple towers. I didn't know what to expect when I bought these, but... This is not what I thought of. I was I wanted to build my own little castle. This is just sad. <laughs> all right, so we're, we'll worry about building later. I don't have all the unlocks anyways. Excuse me. You're supposed to go in there. It's nice that you can actually sell things. So what I did here is set these things up like this. 
that should allow us to do the, the uh, flowers again. And I want to redo that investment. We might have better flowers now. I don't know what I'm going to do with the other sprinklers. We might just have to expand out a little bit. But yeah, if I could fully automate and just have to plant my uh, my flowers, that could be very lucrative because that should be very easy as a daily job just to um, simply essentially sleep once we get our plants planted. Okay, I think honestly primrose, actually these Ganzania seeds might be good. A lot of the flowers take more area than the primrose, though. I think primrose are like secretly one of the best, at least in the early game, for earning money. Let's see if this Ganzania seed... Uh, takes a lot of spots, so I'm gonna test that one, but I might go back to just planting primroses because I should be able to put like nine around these actually Like eight because we probably can't put one in the middle and that might be my best investment So we'll have eight around every one of these things and that should earn us some serious money I think no space in hotbar, of course. All right. Well, hold on here. Let's just sell these the rest of these all right, and let's see how big these ones are. So, okay, yeah, they're actually quite big in comparison. We'll put one down just because I bought it. But I think, oh, yes, I love that they automatically do it when there's uh, a plant around it. But I still think primroses are the way to go. So I'm going to invest heavily back into these things just to earn some more money. Oh, yeah, these are just, look at, look at how much better they are. I can't put any more there because uh, that bigger plant's in the way. That thing earns me pretty much double these, but I still think this is the better way to go. This is so pleasing, actually. Well, I made a small investment into uh, primroses again. Just, you know, just a small one, aka all my freaking money. This is, uh, I'm kind of insane, honestly. Oh, yeah, I forgot about you. Thank you. Look, I'm, I'm, I think I'm only missing a few small ones. Like, that one's right in the middle of these ones. We don't have sprinklers going all the way over here. Oh, my God. I'm lagging. <laughs> How many primroses are here? All right. Now that this is all automated, all I have to do is pick a few weeds. We should be able to just call it a day. It's going to take, I think, six days for these things to grow. So, it is a little bit of a waiting game. But at least I don't got to freaking water them. And look at that. Listen to the sound of success. Oh my god, there's so many weeds though. So yeah, all I have to do every day is uh, just explore and find all the weeds. They actually kind of hide in here quite well. But yeah, by the time I find them all, these things should be pretty much watered. I love this uh, automated money. It's the best. Good morning, my sprinklers. Yes, you guys are doing good. I'm just going to stand here and look at this until they all go to check marks. All right, so we're going to up our trader to max because I'm leveling up like crazy doing this, which is kind of why I'm doing it. And then obviously, I didn't even know that the income uh, is improved with this as well. So florist, we're definitely going to upgrade as well. We should hopefully max it out by the time these things are ready to harvest. Oh my God, it is harvest. Hey, we got 60 weeds. 60 weeds is too many. Of course, this one's still not ready to go. This is why I, I hate everything but primroses. They take too much space and they take too long to grow. Look at this. It's beautiful aside from the absurd amount of weeds. Now, I have an idea. I did notice when I uh, chopped up the um, pepper plants that were here, I was actually earning money. So I think you get the idea. I might not even need to harvest these. Let me actually see. 21. 21 is oh no wait wait that wasn't that wasn't grown damn it all right so hold on let's just test this with ones that have actually grown pick primrose so just gonna 45 hmm how much did i pay for these so i get 45 i pay 28 if i harvest them normally i get 60 but i don't get 60 because i have so many skills i should get oh man I really wish if it gave me like 70, I would probably do just this. It's 45 each. I'm still profiting if I wanted to just do this quickly, but I think it's smart to actually just, oh my God, it's so freaking long though. All right, screw it. I'm just going to do it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> look, at, look at how many bags there are. I mean, I'm not earning much money, but I'm doing no work doing this. Actually, now that I think about it, I gotta... Oh, this game's evil. It figured out a way to not fully automate this, because now I have a million freaking bags. So, I think for the rest of these, I'll just manually do them, because it's going to be just as hard as transferring these hundreds of bags. Actually, 
I get 32 bucks for doing this as well. So it would be about 70 if I did it this way. I mean, it's still a long process, but that's good. I, I forgot that I get paid for doing this, and I also get XP, so at least I'm leveling up as well. I think I get XP for just mowing these things down as well. No, it looks like it's just money, unfortunately. <laughs> this is this is not how this game's intended to be played. All right, but that still earned me uh, 12200 so the majority of my investment back. After a little bit more of a harvest, this is basically pure profit. Um, so I'm going to do it the, the boring way now, the actual way you're supposed to play this. Okay. And after a couple more days, I had a few that weren't fully grown. We have, uh, well, almost exactly 60 K also, as you can see, installed a lot more sprinklers. We can actually fully automate this whole system. Now I can plant things wherever the hell I want. And, uh, yeah, all we have to do is deal with weeds then, and, uh, well, there's a lot of them, unfortunately. Thankfully, there's nothing planted right now, so I can simply just mow them. All right, so let's celebrate by getting the front area, uh, just because I can. And I also want to get the lawn robot. I'm so close to it. All right, well, actually, our grass is regrown, so we can just kind of hopefully finish this up right now. We don't have much grass left. I didn't really plan this out. Uh, but yeah, we should... Uh, oh, god damn it. I just ran over more more plants. But yeah, we're gonna have to deal with this. So, um... Yeah, we should have enough grass to hopefully unlock the robot now. Alright, so I have to grab the package so I can snip... I don't even know which one I bought. Was it this one? Nope. It must be the other side. Alright, so it is this one. I just had to hold the item. And there we go! Yay! I just want to mow this down so I can <laughs> unlock my robot so I can automate this as well. Okay, relax. It's a little over the top. All right, so it wants me to use stones and fences, I guess, uh, so I can unlock the robot. I have mowed enough to uh, get it. So yeah, I just need to place these things now and we should be good. So what we're going to do is just simply block this thing off. I can't put these right side by side. That's kind of annoying, but okay. What the? What did I just do? No, I want... Oh my god, why is this so confusing? Oh, okay, bye. <laughs> god damn it. Alright, I had to buy two more fences because one flew away and I accidentally disposed of one. I added uh, these rocks here. I hope I can sell these later because this is just to unlock the robot. It's kind of nice though, actually. But now, yes, I can get... Mr. Lawn Robot, and it's so cheap. That, or, or I'm just rich in this game, I guess. All right, so I'm curious. Can I turn this off and on whenever I want? Because I might be able to fully automate my system with robotics. Um, all right, it's going to do its thing. It should be, yes, blocked. Look at it go. It's way better than even me. Oh, this is great. So I can just pick it up and move it, probably? Hold on, let's find out. Come here, big guy. And then I can just drop it. And it's going to do its thing. It's just going to mow the cat. That's right. I, lo I love you even more now. All right. It's pretty good. It's not the most smart of robot, but it does seem to actually target wherever the grass is, as you can see. This is actually fantastic. All right. You've done a good enough job here. Come here. There's a lot to do over here. So you just have fun and I shall be back. The worst part about this is you can't just buy a full stack. You actually have to click for every seedling. So this is still a little bit of a process. And the max you can hold is 64 on, on every slot for some reason. I have to be honest, uh, don't know if the gardening coins are worth the carpal tunnel I'm going to get after this. This, uh... <laughs> I, I might be losing my mind. I don't, I don't know. I don't think I need this many primroses. Um, well, I did it. Uh, that's like over a thousand primroses planted. I'm going to be a millionaire one day. Well, actually in six days, to be more precise. Ah, uh, now all my hard work is done. I just sit here and wait. This is fantastic. Also, planting all those has given me four more skill points. So that maxes out my florist. And well, everything else I don't really care about right now. So we'll just throw some skills into that. Okay, well, I probably missed a few small spots. So I'm going to buy a few more and fill those holes. Okay, today is the big day. Look at... Look at how beautiful it is! Oh, I'm so excited right now. Now, I really hope this works because I invested hard, uh, well, kind of hard, into uh, robots because I want to fully automate this as well. So my logic is if I earn money mowing myself... Yes! All right, hold on, buddy. Hold on. 
Oh, this was such a good idea. I, uh, my brilliance knows no boundaries. Be free, my brothers! Yes, go earn me money! Uh oh Come on, it's okay. It's okay. We, we might have to spread them out a bit. Yes! Oh, this is great. This is exactly how gardening's supposed to be. We have a traffic jam. It's okay, because I don't have to do anything right now. I don't think the game knows what's going on anymore. It's like, this is not intended. Uh, some of them are working. I'm just gonna have to help them a bit. There we go. You guys, come on. Come on. There we go. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's such an annoying noise. Look at my money. Oh, yes. This is freaking beautiful. Oh, I love it. I mean, I'm only earning 45. It was honestly a lot of work to plant all those. If there's an auto planter, I am set for life. Uh, I should probably help these guys, you know, get rid of some of these because they're definitely going to get in the way. Or, or we're just going to lag out and freaking crash the game by the end of this. They're not even moving anymore. Come on, guys. Keep working. All right. They're seem to be working again, which is nice. Uh, problem is these garbage bags are in the freaking way. Can I mow the garbage bags? Uh, no, that wouldn't make sense because that's what makes the garbage bags. But I shall help you guys. Let's do this together, everybody. Oh my god, the lag. This is... This is stupid. This is... I admit, this is stupid, but hey. It's fun, and I just wanted to see if I could automate gardening. And you know what? I'm gonna argue I was pretty freaking close. There's still quite a few flowers left. Unfortunately, there's a lot more garbage bags. <laughs> what the hell? What am I doing with my life? That took me so long to do. Like, so absurdly long. And now I just have a whole freaking lawn of garbage bags. Okay, guys, I need a little bit of a break. I hope you guys enjoyed this very realistic version of Garden Simulator. Um, yeah, I'm gonna say automation went well. We unlocked the lawnmower today, aka my money feeders. And, uh, I'm worried I'm gonna crash my game now. So, yeah, let me know if you guys want to see more of this. I don't know what else we can get into in this game. But it's fun doing gardening in a totally realistic way. Oh, thanks for the 45 bucks. That was really, really nice of you. Yes, keep keep going, guys. You guys are doing good. As always, guys, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one.